These are difficult moments, emotional moments, I guess. Save for me. Tears roll down. Tears of joy. Tears of joy. We're going to celebrate. Actually, it was in Lusophonia games. I was in the Taj at Vivanta. I just happened to, you know, look up, just look up, and there she was, you know, just standing. And she had this particular flower that is called the Aralia flower. And I think that was it. That was it. He looked at me, and he says, "Every time I looked at you, something just said, you know, she was the one." From there, it was like a little flower just, you know, waiting to bloom. I kept my word because just before I left, I said, "No, I'm coming back. I'm coming back." He came back in April when he went to the church. He finished praying, and then he looks at me and he said, "He said, you know why I've come here? I've come here because I made a vow to God that if you say yes to me, I'm coming back." I think that I think that's the beauty, though. Know? You know, you travel around the world, and then unexpectedly, you find this person in in Goa. All I can say is thank you God, you know. You know thank God because I, I believe He has already written our destiny. And what touched me the most about Him is He's so God-fearing, He's so pious. Like I was telling the priest today, what brought us together was His whole vow that He did with God and said, okay, if she says yes to me, I'm going to come back. I would have never thought that I would I was going to meet Nidhi. Your parents are so proud of you, your sister. They have been the core of your life and they have seen you through your ups and downs and supported you, loved you. You now go into another phase of your life where you have chosen somebody to be that part of your life. Sometimes you pray and it doesn't come. Like God says, you know, wait and it'll come to you. You know, it, it, it doesn't happen overnight. But yes, it came. It finally came. The way it's gone, we've lasted. We've seen each other eight times in these 1,400 days. I think that's what made us stronger, even stronger. The commitment and the bond that we shared to bring our lives together all these years, it's stronger than anything. I, Nidhi, take you, Conrad, to be my husband. I promise to be true to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health. I will love you and honor you all the days of my life. It's very strange. He grew up in Sri Lanka, finished his uh, training in Australia. He is uh, in China, employed. He travels to India and finds his bride here. And we're happy for Conrad. He looks very happy together with his, his wife. Yeah. You know, they are so amazing. They're such a beautiful couple. I mean, the couple, what can you say? They are so cute. They are, I mean, absolutely stunning. My heart is filled with joy seeing these two. It's a dream come true. And I think it's better than swimming at the Olympics. Because it's a, it's a life partner you know, who will always be there for you.